Hey team, it's Deshi Omar from Elite Martial Arts. I hope everyone is doing well uh, today. Today we're going to be going for some star testing. So what we're going to do is we're going to just review all five of our stars and see what we can do to, to work on either getting closer to our star or maybe even earning our stars this week. So here's what we're going to do. Let's start with the blue star. So blue star, you got your hands to your side, your back straight. The first step of the blue star is doing 50 perfect jumping jacks. So your hands have to come all the way up and all the way down 50 times all by yourself. Good luck. Go! Next, after your 50 jumping jacks, we do 40 squats. So your hands come up by your cheek, back is straight. You're going to squat down low and stand up. Squat low, stand up 40 times. Go for it. Next, we're going to do 30 sit-ups. So you might need a partner for this one. You're going to be on your back. You're going to sit all the way up, keeping your feet to the floor, your hands up, tagging your partner's shoulders 30 times. Two, three, all the way to 30. The final set is 20 perfect push-ups. So in order for the push-up to count and be considered perfect, they need to be un uninterrupted into 20 perfect without stopping. My hands are going to be underneath my shoulders. I'm looking up, my body is flat, and my job is to bring my chin down to the floor and then all the way back up without letting any other part of my body touch. Let's do that 20 times. Go for it. All right, guys, we're going to go over how to test for the yellow star if you're a basic little dragon. Now, I'm going to be using a purple belt just so you can see it on my black uniform. My black belt sometimes blends in, especially on video. Um, so the first thing I want to do is find the middle of the belt. I find the middle and I hold it out just like this. Next, I'm going to put the middle all the way behind me, just like this. And I cross my belt and make a letter X. I cross it in front of me. The one that's on top is going to tuck under and then I fold nice and tight. From here, I should be able to just let it go. Next, I look at my belt. I should see one that's falling over and one that's falling under. The one that's falling under is gonna tuck, it's gonna flip upside down and then tuck under. The one that's falling over is gonna go over. I tuck it.
Now let's test for that black star. For you to test for that black star, all that's required is for you to drop down to your full split. Um, <laughs> okay, don't laugh at me, team. I'm gonna be here, you open up your feet as wide as you can, and you go lower and lower until you can't go anymore. The goal is to go all the way down. Then she used to be able to do this, and he got old. And uh, if you're laughing, I'm sure this will happen to you too. You're gonna hold it nice and low, as low as you can. Remember, the more time you spend here, the lower and lower you get. Um, in order to kind of help you get lower and lower with your split, what we're gonna do is challenge you a little bit. Two ways to do this. Number one is you can find two, you can start to elevate your split, right? So you do this, not by yourself. Make sure you have two people to help you. Um, that she doesn't have two people to help him, so I'm just gonna kind of speak about it. So you only need two chairs. From here, you'll also need something in front to keep your hands on so you don't lose your balance and end up falling. You're gonna start off by putting one foot on one chair, the other foot <laughs> on the other chair, um, and make sure you have people to help you. Uh, I'm by myself, so I'm not gonna fail on camera, but what you're gonna do is have your feet up on both chairs, hold on to something, and the moral of the story is people are gonna slowly stand behind the chair and slowly, slowly pull the pads or the chairs further and further to really let gravity work on your legs and, um, you know, stretch you out a little bit. All right? Have fun with that. The next star is the green star. Green star means consistent attendance and pretty much dedication and discipline to your training. So those students who send me videos of you consistently training, even during this, uh, this closing, I will give you that green star if you don't have one. This is just showing an unbelievable amount of, of dedication to your training and we're so proud of you for doing that. The red star will go for the student who I think in each individual class is going the hardest. So, if you want that red star when you're practicing at home with your jumping jacks, your squats, and throughout the rest of your training, throughout the rest of the videos that I'll be sending, definitely make sure that you're moving fast, yelling loud, and working as hard as you can to try to get a little sweat. And that student who I see really, really pushing themselves, you'll get that red star. And I'll announce it live on, uh, on one of our Facebook groups. All right, guys, we're gonna review some of our nunchuck basics. So you're gonna keep your right hand tight in chamber, I'm sorry, your left hand tight in chamber, your nunchuck in your right hand, and you're gonna go for 10 fast backward twirls. 10 seconds, go. Perfect, now bring it up. 10 forward twirls, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. 10 up and downs, one, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten catches. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Switch to this side. Now let's repeat that. Ten backward twirls, ten forward twirls, ten up and downs, and then ten catches. Perfect. Good job, team. Go for it. Go! Good. Now let's work on our switch catches. Switch catches. So catch, switch, catch, switch, catch, switch. Very nice. Three, two. Let's add three twirls. One, two, three, catch. 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 And one, two, three, catch. Ready, stance? Good. Catch on this side. Let's see your one, two, three. One, two, three. Again. One more. Keep going. 30 seconds. Begin. 30 seconds on this side. Go. Now we're gonna do our one, two, three. So you're striking across, 
to the other hip, and then you catch. One, two, three. We're gonna do that for one minute. Begin. Switch sides. Now one minute on this side. Begin. Perfect. Ready stance? Now, here's what I want to see. You're going to do your forward figure eight. So you're going to keep one hand in chamber and you're just going to make a big letter X. Definitely make sure you have a whole lot of space doing this one. Don't be close to any TVs. Phases, brothers, sisters, anything. <laughs> Be away from everything and make that letter X. Next, keep your elbow close to your body and use a little less of your arm. And the final step is for you to just use your wrist, rolling your wrist here, keeping a tight chamber. Let's try that for one minute. Go. Great job. Great job with your nunchucks, team. Let's snap. Bow. Put your nunchucks away and then we'll come right back. Great job training today. I look forward to seeing you guys soon. Let's put your arms out, feet together. Snap. Bow. Hands in the middle. One, two, three. EMA. Good job, team. See you soon.